welcome back to the spider's web and as you can see we have our Malifo uh, Neverborn figures here from the two player starter set they're all glued together the bases are all done as they were in the last video let's get them glued down then shall we <laughs> right so first of all a little bit of super glue and there's not much in the line of surface to work with with these minis so I'm just hoping that this glue is going to be strong enough to hold them done and another now I'm not going to do all of them because as you know if you've listened to any of the other videos or watched any of the other videos I'm doing one faction and Ali is doing the other faction and this is my faction so I want Ali to get her own done. Um, I'm going to go, I think I'm going to do something a little different with this fella. Have a little more surface area to work with with this guy. He seems to be wearing great big clothed up in boots. And once one foot seems quite shorter than the other. So that will be okay for putting one foot on one of the dips in that one. And finally, we'll have this guy. And in case you're wondering what the scuff marks are on the bottom of these, on the bottom of the feet, um, I've used a emery board to sand some of it down so that. We're getting a, uh, a rough texture, so hopefully some of the Oop. it will allow it to stick a lot better. Not in the hope that some of it will uh, do something. So here we are, and there we have the two blood wretches, angel eyes. The scion of blood, I think it is. So there's angel eyes. So now on her base, and he's looking quite impressive on his actually. And next is the scion of black blood. Actually this guy, he's a bit of a beefy looking fella. Okay, he's not got what you call none of these have got really dynamic a very dynamic pose. I suppose the only ones that have anything similar virtually near the dynamic pose are these two blood wretches, but still there's not much movement in these. It's just like the stood around shambling and virtually standing around posing more than anything else but that's it it's actually off the uh, insert there. Nothing really I can do about it unfortunately but there we go. Next job is to prime them and then paint them. Um, I'm not going to do anything more with those. Um, I do have Ali's bases here which she wants to use. Um, let me just show you those. Get them out of the 
box. Here are, these are the ones that I've chosen to use. This one with the curbstone, the little grid. Then you've got the straight cobble street. Another cobble with a, a wheel on it. And this is a, a curb, well, paving flags with a little bit of the cobble street there. But they're the ones Ali, Ali's going to be using for hers. She chose them. So I'll put them back in the box. And bring these back into camera shots so you can you've got something to look at just while I uh, say as usual at the end of my videos I know this is again only a short one but uh, next time you see these they will be primed I won't be starting painting along with the uh, I'm going to cracking on some more of the um, Dungeon Circus stuff as well so we're going to have two lots side by side I think but uh, for now as always take care god bless and bye for now